bother with people she hates. That's why the lady is a tramp. She likes a free fresh wind in the hair. Life without care. She's a rogue. I know. It's so I'd miss an important meeting, thereby sending my entire company into ruin. Also, you wouldn't have to feel the pressure of having to follow in my footsteps. Mom, none of that is true. Really? I'm so disappointed in you. I'm sorry. Next time I'll try to be more devious. You know, I think you're being brainwashed by that dangerous gang you run with. It's the young Republicans. If your father were alive to hear you say that. Mom, Dad is alive. Oh, God, more bad news. <laughs> Where did I go wrong with you? I made sure all the nannies spoke English. I read all those manuals. I breastfed you. Oh. For the first few days. Listen, I have to finish getting ready for school. Mwah. Oh, um, by the way, I'll be stopping by Grandma's house on the way home. Anything you want me to tell her? She's a selfish woman who never understood me, and I'm anxiously awaiting my inheritance. <laughs> I'll send you your love. Oh, that's what I meant. Oh, um, by the way, there's a little surprise for you on the dining room table. Oh, sweetheart. You made me breakfast. No, not quite. Oh, God, Ellie. Ellie? Ellie! Eleanor! Ah! It's all right. I'm alive. Not barely. Makeup? Still on. Oh, thank God. <laughs> what time is it? Nine o'clock. A.M. or P.M.? A.M. Central or Pacific? Eastern. Bizarre. It's also hazy. <laughs> You're in New York on my dining room table where you passed out last night after the fabulous party I threw at the Water Club to kick off the book tour of your newest novel, which I published. Still nothing. Hmm. <laughs> it was a huge success. You're a big star. The world envies you. Oh, that's right. It's all back now. <laughs> Regular menthol. Regular. Lights are 100. 100. Imported or domestic. Oh, just put a tailpipe in my mouth and turn the engine on. <laughs> Last night was epic. This is your best book. I'm so proud of you. Double Day is seething. <gasps> Margaret Windsor insisted she was the inspiration for the character of Helen. And when I denied it, she called me a bitch. A bitch. <laughs> I'm not, am I? You are the kindest, sweetest woman I know. Of course, if someone were having a seizure in your bathtub, you'd throw in your laundry. <laughs> don't forget you have that big Herald Examiner interview today. Well, Don, look at me. I don't think I can. Well, fine, don't do it. Ruin me, bankrupt me, destroy the company I struggled and strained to create. Dot, you got that publishing company in your divorce settlement. True, <laughs> but I struggled and strained through that marriage, didn't I? <laughs> Ellie, please. What? He's 17. And? He's my son. Oh, I knew there was something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Go home and change into something less blinding. I'll pick you up on my way to the office. Fine. Oh, and Dot, when will he be 18? <laughs> Four more years. Table. Table? I was 